Hi. <laughs> so I got this new thing. It's really echoey in here. And I got, I got keys. I'm in like a, a new apartment. I've been living in a gym. See, now some people say they're living in a gym and that means like they go to the gym. No, a friend of mine let me live in his gym for the last six months. So yeah, I did, I worked out a lot. <laughs> But I also uh, was woken up by music at 5.15 in the morning every single morning. Um, so, but now I am officially move-in date, so have keys and all. And this is my new little place. It looks at the woods. Let's see, we'll go, we'll take, give you on a little tour. And you tell me, I'd love to know your tips for, uh, you know, moving in. <laughs> Cause I gotta get everything, I don't got nothing. So I'm gonna do something different with this space though. This is just so, this is the door you walk in. So, oh, let's go out here, who can have to do it? Come on, this is like, I feel like I'm in like a really low version of Cribs. And then look, this is my little like, little alcove there, right? And we walk in here and then we've got here, I'll flip it around. So we'll flip a flip a flip a flip a flip. Where's the flip? Oh, there. So we got this space right now. So what would you put in this space? Now I know everyone does the living room thing, but I'm gonna do like more of an office-y type thing. And here's what's really cool. This is why I got this place. So that's my view is the woods. And that's a state park and there's a path down there. And there's miles and miles. I don't really like the power lines, but what are you gonna do? Um, maybe I'll ask them to move those. But then I've got my little outdoor patio area here. Oh, a little outdoor patio area. Oh, oh. And then I can go into the state forest right there. Right there. There you go. Bloop. Right in there. Yep. And then down there. Down there. Okay. Oh, that's enough. <laughs> that's enough of that. And we go back in. So yeah, give me your tips for moving in. I'd love to know what they are. That's why I was making this video. And then we've got, oh, let's see. What's this? I don't even open this door. Oh, there's the bathroom. Let's check it out. Bathroom. Oh, look at that. We got jacuzzis and jets. I got, I think I could actually fit in that tub. I think I could. That's cool. I can't usually fit in tubs. Kind of a big guy. All right, let's see. We got kitchen. Got nice little, got a little one bedroom. I love it. Well, we got this. Oh, yeah. All right. Good, good, good. We got this. So yeah, hey Becky, Courtney, Mike, what's going on, man? This is where my washer and dryer will go. That's getting installed tomorrow. So yeah, that's cool. What else we got? Um, I think that's it. <laughs> I think that's the tour. I love it. Uh, I love it. It's so small and perfect. Okay. So that's my little tour. And uh, here's look how big. So I'm 6'3". I can't reach the ceiling. I think they're like nine foot ceilings. So it feels really big in here too. So you can see how big the ceilings are. That's a thing. Yeah. With when you're a big guy, it's good to have big ceilings. So I'd love to know, you know, throw your tips of if you've moved in the past, that I'm sure you have, you know, what are some essentials? What would you do with this space, this, this living room space? Would you sofa it up? Would you, I want to do like a standing table, like, I want to do something over here so when I'm working, I might put like a little table desk right here so I can kind of look out there. I don't really know, because then, I don't know. I would just love to hear your ideas, get some tips from you, see what you think you would do with this space. This is just going to be bedroom, of course, kind of boring. Uh, but my stuff for this is coming tomorrow. But what I really like about it is, this is what I really like about it. I like this place. Hello, Jazzy. These are very big lines. Okay. So, let's just imagine this, right? Now here, we'll, do, we'll flip it around, right? If, you're, if I'm lying in bed, I wake up to that view. <laughs> to like the woods. I love it. It feels like I'm in, living in the woods. So, because my bed is going to go here, right? There, and then I'll be lying on the bed. And then that's what I'll wake up to. So, yeah. Very cool. I do thank you. Hey, yes, yeah, Florida. Carolyn, awesome. Thank you for hopping on. Natasha, checking out the new. And this is my closet. It's a pretty big closet. Eh? Eh? Pretty big. My whole life fits in a friend of mine's car that she let me borrow. So I borrowed a car. 
Because <laughs> that's next on the list. Most people don't know this about me, but I haven't had a driver's license in six years. By design, not because everyone's like, oh, did you lose it, DW? No, I, I just don't have a license. <laughs> um, but I'm going to get a new one, and yeah. It'll be good. We'll get a car, you know, crazy things. Well, we had, I had a car, but I didn't really drive it because I didn't have a license. But now I do. Now I will. So, yeah. Now I can come out here and chill out in the, in the woods. So, yeah. I moved twice in my life. Once when I was 12. 38 years of stuff. Wow, Jazzy. Wow, that's crazy. That's cool. But I've moved, like, I don't know, 3,000 times <laughs> in the last, like, 10 years. So, but yeah. So thanks for joining me. If you have any tips, Jazzy, you've got any t you probably don't have any tips because you haven't moved that many times. But if you have any tips of, you know, what I should, I need to get, like I need, I know I need like my pots and my pans. I'm gonna go get that stuff today. Um, but anything else that I might not be thinking of, I'd love to hear what course call just came in. But yeah, so have an awesome day. I'm gonna go move some stuff. And, uh, and have some have some fun putting the place together. So I'll see you soon. Maybe I'll take you on another tour when it's all set up in a week or so. So awesome. Talk to you soon. Bye.